Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Hello, thank you. Hi Good there. Evening. Good evening. Welcome, Jenny. How are you doing tonight? Thank you. I'm great. Glad to hear. Glad to hear. Well, I like that punctuality from you. And um, what's new? Everything okay? Yes. All right. I'm glad to hear that. Let me say welcome to Ana Lopez. Hello, Miss Anita Lopez. How are you doing? Okay, maybe, oh, it's raining. Where, where at? Where is it raining? Where are you? Hi, my dear Spinoza. How you doing? Hello, oh. teacher. What's going on? What's new? Fine, and you? Um, I'm okay. I'm okay. Nothing new. The same working day, same routine as usual, but I'm glad to meet you at this time. Are you ready? Yes. Ready to practice your present perfect skills? Uh, no, la clase de ayer no, no entré. You were absent. Okay. So this, ayer, we continue with present perfect. We continue mm -hmm. with present perfect, really important. We will have a very, very, um, let's say, um, complete full conversation today using present perfect so we can help you to, you know, make it better, get it better, okay? Okay. Okie dokie, so let me say welcome to Catherine Ramirez. Hello, Miss Catherine. How are you Hi, doing? Teacher. What's new there? What's new? <laughs> I am very happy. You look very happy. Why are you so happy? Uh, I visited uh, my mother. Oh, really? Oh, nice, nice. So you don't live with your mother? No. Okay, so you I, visited her. I live with my hus my husband. Uh, husband. husband. Okay, 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 yes. okay. Good, good, good. So you're very happy, and she is very happy too, I guess. Uh, thank you. Yes. Where is that? Where, where? What city is she in? Excuse what, me. What city is your mother in? Um. Hayake. She's in Hayake. Oh, nice, nice, nice. And you live in Hayake too? And no, I live in Ciudad, Ciudad Arce. Arce City. Yes. Arce City. Nice, 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 nice. Is it raining? Is it raining in Arce City? Is it is it raining there? No. Um no. No, it's not. Okay, okay, okay. Well, well, I'm so glad to see you. Hey, maybe Ana Lopez doesn't have um, access to... Oh, you're in a watch Japan. The Hokute City, huh? Nice, 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 nice. I want to go there. I want to go there. <laughs> we have been having fun with Present Perfect these last classes. It's a very extensive topic, you know. It's a very, very um, extensive because there's a lot to say. There's a lot to say using present perfect. Um, I'm going to have, I would like to have a conversation using present perfect, okay, with all of you. So I'm going to share some questions with you. I have prepared some questions that you can also use, okay? You can choose your favorite question. And I'm going to, oops, I'm going to, I'm going to get it pasted here on this chat and meet.
and also on on our personal WhatsApp chat. Let me know if you receive it. Let me see. Hmm. Give me one second. There you go. Can you check this message, please? Can you check the message? You're supposed to have a bunch of questions using present perfect. Bless you, bless you, miss, bless you. <laughs> okay, so I want you to check those questions out and I want you to choose your favorite questions so we can start having a conversation. All right, all right. Give me one second here. So I'm going to share this as well on the WhatsApp chat, just in case, just in case. Okay, choose your favorite one. Let me start up. Why don't I start with asking you something related to this topic, which is uh, studying English. Studying English is something that you started in the past and this action, this activity will never stop. You started learning English, what? One year ago, since what? Specific year, but you will continue studying English. You will continue learning English because it never stops. There's a lot of information. Okay. So my question is, how long have you studied English? Let me start with Jenny. How long have you studied English? Do you remember that, Jenny? Uh, yes, I remember, but I study English um, since three, three years. Wait, wait, wait. Did you say, did you say yes. I or I have? I have. Okay, okay, okay. So you said I have studied, you have studied English since three years. So in that case, three years, isn't it a period of time? So you would use four, for three years. Four, four, three years. Yes, because it's it's three years, it's, it's a period of time. Good. So you have studied English for three years. Okay. Interesting, thank you. How about you, my dear? How long have you studied English? I I am how studying English. Wait, in... wait, I am? That's I... not present perfect. You need to use have. I have. I have, uh, okay. Yeah. I have studied English. Mm, two two years. Two and you years. say you say for two years or since two years. For two years, two years. For two years, and you say years. and you say. Do you say studying or studied? Is study. Studying or studied. We're using we're using present perfect, my day. So we're not using am, um, we're not using the verb to be, but we're using the auxiliary, have or has, depending the subject. In okay. addition to that, you need to use the past participle verb. The PP, the PP verb. Some people say the PP verb. So that's um, study. The it's a regular verb, so ends with ed. Studied, studied. I have studied English. Um, one year, one year. Guys, one year. Think about it. One year. Is it a period of time, or is a specific point in time? 
period of time. It's a period of time because it's 12 months. It's 12 months. It's a period of time. So it's four. Four, okay. Uh, who was that? Anna? Anita? Since you're going to use it when it's a specific year. For example, in the case of Jenny, she said she has studied English for three years. So that would be what? Since 2019, around that, maybe? So she has studied English since 2019. Okay. Okay. Choose one question. Let's see. Jenny, it's your turn. You're going to interview us with your question. Ready? Jenny, are you there? I'm sorry, teacher. My connection is 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 bad. Okay. Uh, okay, okay. No problem. Okay, tell me again, please. Can you hear me? Yes, now. Yes. Okay, now is your turn, okay? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I didn't ask Catherine. I'm sorry. Wait, give me one second. Okay, don't worry. Catherine, okay, don't worry. Can you hear me? Catherine? Hi, teacher. Okay, my mm -hmm. question for you is, how long have you studied English? I have studied English uh, for uh, six um, months. Good, good, excellent. That is correct. Thank you. Now we can move. We can move to the next question and I'm gonna pass the microphone to Jenny. She's going to say her question and she's going to interview us. Go ahead, Jenny. Tell me, tell me. What's Repeat your question? Again, please. What's your question, Jenny? Choose one question. Uh, but I, I, and for the, for the chat? Yes, the ones on the chat, from the ones on the chat, yes. Okay, for whatever people here? For everyone, everyone must answer. Everyone okay. must answer. Okay, um, for Katrin, what is the best and worst restaurant you have eaten at? What is the best restaurant you have eaten at? Correct? Hello? Hello, hello? Friends. <gasps> the best restaurant you have eaten at. Um, excuse me, sería con nombre. Yeah, the best restaurant oh. I have eaten at is what? Pizza Hut, for example. <laughs> yeah, I'm, having, I'm having the best restaurant in the <laughs> I, I have your a, a restaurant Tio Lito <laughs> Something like that. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. Thank you, Catherine. Can you make a question to somebody? Can you choose a question, please? Yes. Okay. Um, la misma. You can choose a different question. Okay. Um, uh, 
Correct, Anna, that's correct. I have studied English for one year. Okay. What is the most exciting thing you have Ex ever done? Exciting. Exciting. What is the most, the most exciting, exciting thing? Exciting thing. Uh huh. You have ever done. What is the most exciting thing you have ever done? That's a very interesting question. In my case, the most exciting thing uh, I I have done. Let me see. I have gone on the um, on a banana thing on the um, Coatepeque Lake. You know, one of those bananas that are pulled by a by a by a little boat. You know, so it was kind of fun. It was kind of fun to. To, to fall there, you know, but we were wearing, you know, our vests. So it was very, it was very exciting, to be honest with you. It was extremely exciting. Yeah. Falling, falling was the, was the most exciting part. But yeah, that's the most exciting thing I have ever done. I have done so far. What about you, Jenny? What about you? Uh, in my case, I don't have a, I, I, I don't have but uh, uh, a thing exciting, uh, but I don't like it. This the emotion, but it's you don't it's like, you don't like to exceed the, this, you don't like to exceed uh, the, the emotions. No, no. Yeah. I, so, I, uh huh. Go ahead. Okay. I I it, for me is my my preferred this. Uh, uh, as, as I see it in, in the different places, I can see the mountain, I see on the lake, but no, it's, I just prefer this, but no exciting. Not the exciting part. No, nothing, nothing, Be nothing, nothing. Because exciting, exciting, sometimes it's a little dangerous, right? Yeah. In, in general. I, yes. I get you. I get you. I follow you, Jenny. No problem. We okay. understand each other. <laughs> and it's, it's, it's good. It's good. So you okay. like to be in the quiet places, right? A little yes. relaxed. That's good. That's yeah, exactly. Good. But maybe, maybe, maybe uh, you can associate exciting with a moment when you actually felt something really special. You follow me? Maybe the most exciting thing for you was uh, when, you, when you fell in love, for example. So when, when, I, when, you, met, when, uh, when you met your, your significant other, right? So the most exciting thing or the most exciting moment for me um you know has been when i met my significant other for example right so it can be it can be not really an, an action related kind of thing but it can be something that you know it touches you right touches your feeling all right let me go next i want to go next uh let me see let me see okay <laughs> okay. Um, what sports have you played? Okay, Jenny. What sports have you played? Um, I I I practice soccer. Tell me simple. T tell me present. Oh, perfect. okay, 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 okay. I I have played. Soccer. Um, things. Um, but I remember all the time plays soccer. Okay, okay, okay. So you have played soccer, right? That's good. That's good. How about you, Catherine? Have you played what sports? What sports have you played? <laughs> 
I haven't played. <laughs> any sports? No. Repeat, I haven't played any sports. I haven't played any sport. You haven't played the volleyball? No. <laughs> volleyball, like, uh, how about baseball with the bat? No. You haven't played baseball at all? Okay, no. Okay, okay. Mala, mala, mala. <laughs> bad, bad, bad for sports. Okay, okay. Maybe you have a different kind of likes. How about you, my dear? What sports have you played? I have uh, basketball. I have played. Played basketball. Played basketball. Say, 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 I have played. I have played basketball very well and have you been on tv have you been on tv my day yes uh-huh uh-huh tell us say i have been i have been I have been on such TV program, on such TV channel. Uh -huh. No comprendo mucho. No. The question uh -huh. is the question the question. Is, questions. Have you been on TV? Not is do you watch TV? No, no, no. Have mm -hmm. you Por been? Eso. Have you appeared on television? Have you been on TV? Do you understand the question, Jenny? Yes, but I I I haven't been on TV. Okay, okay, okay. Good, 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 good. How about you, Catherine? Have you been on TV? Have you been <laughs> on television? Have you been on television? Yes, I I have been on television. I have been I, on television, uh-huh. I like. But do you understand the question? Um más o menos, um, have you been on television? It's like a person was taking, you know, camera on you and you appear on television. You appear on, on one channel, on channel two, channel six, whatever. No? No. Okay, so you, your answer is negative. I haven't. You say, no, I haven't been on television. I haven't been on television. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Yes, thank you for the practice, ladies. Thank you for the practice. That was a little practice with a present perfect. So let's go ahead and choose, choose. What did I say choose? Let's go ahead and share our screen with you. All right, can you visualize my screen now? Can you see? Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Okay, perfect. Yes. Let's watch this one. Hi, in this lesson, we will work on pronunciation in order to sound natural by linking final t and t sounds in verbs with vowels that follow. Listen and practice. Final t and d sounds in verbs are linked to the vowels that follow them. Have you cooked lunch yet? Yes, I've already cooked it. Have you ever tried Cuban food? Yes, I tried it once in Miami. Now, I want you to practice answering the following questions. Use it in your responses. Pay attention to the linked sound. Make sure you record your response. Have you cooked lunch yet? Okay, check the pronunciation. Have you cooked lunch yet? We're kind of linking them, putting them together. Can you repeat, have you cooked lunch yet? Have, have you, you cooked cook lunch yet? yet? Repeat. Have you cooked lunch yet? Have, have you, you cooked, cooked lunch, lunch yet? yet? Repeat. Yes. 
I've already cooked it. Yes, yes I've, I've already, already, cooked, already cooked, cooked it. it. Yes, I've already cooked it. Yes, yes I've, I've already, already cooked, cooked it. it. Have you ever tried Cuban food? Have you have ever you tried, ever tried Cuban, Cuban food? Cuban. Have you ever Cuban. tried Cuban food? Have, have you, you ever, ever tried, tried Cuban, Cuban food? food? Cuban. 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 Food. Repeat again, please, this word. Cuban. Cuban. Cuba. 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 Cuba is the country. Cuba. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Cuba okay. is the country. Okay? Mm -hmm. Cuban. Yes. Okay? Cuban. Cuban. That's Cuban. the nationality. That's the um that's the nationality for the country. Okay. So Cuban, okay. Cuban Cuba. food. Cuban. That must be that must be a little aphrodisiac, kind of aphrodisiac food, huh? <laughs> Cuban yeah. food. Okay, so repeat. Yes, I tried it. I tried it. Yes, I tried it. I tried it. Yes, I tried it. Tried it. Yes, I tried it once in Miami. Yes, I, I tried it once in, in Miami. See, uh, it's important to say additional information like the place where you had where you had that activity at, like Miami in this case. In Miami, yes, I try it. I tried it. I tried it once in Miami. I tried it once with my friends. I tried it once with um, my family members there in um, Cuba, for example. So. Try to um, use link sounds with the following questions. Okay, let me choose Jenny. Jenny, you will start. Can you hear me, Jenny? Yes. Okay, can you choose one of these questions for your classmates? Uh, follow the example, the three. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Okay, have you ever cut your hair? Yes, I cut it. No, I haven't cut it. Okay, okay, okay. Can you select one question? We have one, two, three. We have four questions there. Can you choose one question, please? Um, have you ever tasted goat cheese? Okay, have you ever tasted? Repeat, taste. 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 Repeat. Tasted. Tasted. That's the PP verb, okay? Have you ever tasted goat? Goat cheese. Goat cheese. Goat cheese. Have you goat ever cheese. tasted goat cheese? Um, No, I haven't tasted it. Repeat. No, I haven't tasted it. No, no I, I haven't, haven't tasted it. Negative, okay. right? No, I haven't tasted it. No, I haven't no, I tasted haven't it. And affirmative, what's the affirmative? Yes, I, I've tasted goat cheese. Yes, I tasted it. Tasted it. Oh, okay. Um, ah, okay. Um, there in uh, Watch Upon, right? Okay. Yes, I tasted it. Uh, I tasted it back in 1999. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Good. So that's the question that uh, Jenny chose. So I need to hear your answers. Have you ever tasted goat cheese? Jenny, Catherine, my day, Anna. Let's start with you, Jenny. Have you? Uh, no, I haven't tasted goat cheese. No, you haven't. Would you like, would you like to try it? Would you like to try? Would you like to try in the future? No? Sorry, teacher. I, I, my connection is unstable. Okay, unstable, unstable. I don't hear it. Okay, okay. no problem. Yeah, no unstable. Problem. Okay, no problem. say again, please. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, my question is if uh, you want to try gold cheese in the future. Um. I I I like the shit, but no, don't I I haven't tasted the goat cheese. 
Uh huh. You haven't tasted goat cheese, but are you are you open to to try goat cheese in the future? Yes or no? Okay. No. 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 <laughs> I. I don't. Maybe. Maybe no. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Goat cheese. I never tried it, to be honest with you. Okay, how about you, teacher, Catherine? Yeah, uh, teacher. Yes, yes, how about you? Um, yes, taste it. Yes, I've, I've tasted it. I tasted it? Yes. You can say, you can say, yes, I tasted goat cheese. Repeat, yes, I've tasted goat cheese yes i tasted goat cheese or you can say yes i've tasted it yes i've tasted it really really catherine and no um guess um how do you say it's uh, taste taste is, is similar to eat Ah, taste like taste, mm, taste similar ah. to eat. Ah, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Prova, teacher. Yes, 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 yes. It's similar. It's similar to eat. It's very similar to eat. Mm, okay, thank you. So. Have you ever tasted uh, goat cheese? You know what is goat cheese? You know what is a goat? Oh. G O A T. Cabra. Correct. Repeat. Cabra. Queso de cabra. Ay. I haven't. <laughs> oh, you haven't. I understand the question. Yes. And I was like, and I was like, really? I was like, I was going to ask you where, Catherine, where? How much is it? Is it good? Is it the yeah. <laughs> No, I haven't. No, I you haven't. haven't. <laughs> and, and and nowadays cheese in El Salvador is very expensive, right? So I have that curiosity um, of the goat cheese. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How about you, yeah. my day? <laughs> How about you? No, I have tasted it. You haven't? You haven't tasted it? No, I haven't. Would you like to try? <laughs> what? Would you like to try? Mm. No. No. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. It's funny to me because, because you know, people people actually like a uh, goat goat cheese. You know, there are some people that actually uh, use it. They actually eat it. They actually taste it on a daily basis. But us, uh, we are not used to that kind of you know cheese. Teacher, Don't get you, me wrong. I love cheese. I'm a cheese lover. Do, do yeah. you like cheese? Me too. Me yeah. too. Yeah. I love. Me what's too. the name of these? What's the name of these? Uh, mozzarella. Mozzarella and um, capita. And capita wow. cheese. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness! I just love that cheese with beans. <laughs> you got it. Yeah. Ah, with Loroco. Yes. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, but. But it's goat delicious. cheese, mm. but goat cheese <laughs> now is different, right? It's different. But but teacher, you yeah. have you ever tasted a goat a goat milk? Have you ever tasted? Repeat. Yeah. Have you ever tasted goat milk? Mm, yes. Uh, I have tasted it, but 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 not so much. I tasted it a little. Okay. It, was, it was just a little. Uh, it was good. It was good enough. Have you? Have you? Did? No, 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 no. <laughs> no, yeah, I, 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 I tasted it it's, uh, a little, but I don't like it. Oh, you didn't it's, like it. You didn't like it. I didn't like it. Yeah, but it, it's a bit. Oh, no. Mm -mm. Oh, but, but you know, grandparents, they say that that's a vitamin in the morning. 
Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Many people drink it early, 4 a.m., 5 a.m., 6 a.m. They are selling it in the corner of the streets and people, you know, they drink it early in the morning. Yeah. My husband is, is love this goat milk. Your husband loves this goat milk. Interesting. Yes. I, I'm, I'm going to ask a questions for him later, okay? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go to the next question. Can you choose the next question, Catherine? Go ahead. Have you ever treat Korean food? Repeat. Try. Try. T R Y. Right. Right. Guys, wait, guys, remember that English English language is not about translating the language. No. English language is about is about uh, interpreting it. You have to interpret. The principal verb when you talk about food is eat. Yeah? Eat. Then you can also use taste. It's similar. Then you can use you can also use try. Talking about food. Okay. Now, these three verbs you have to manage them, ladies. These verbs are basic verbs. Okay. If it's a basic verb, you have to know it. You have to know it. For example, eat. Repeat eat. Eat. Simple past. What's the simple past? Eight. 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 Like, like, like the number eight, right? Eight. eight. Okay. What is the PP verb? Eighteen. Eaten. 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 You can say eaten, eaten, or eaten. Okay. And that is an irregular verb. Next two verbs are regular verbs. For example, taste, 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 simple present, taste, simple past, taste, tasted. 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 With, with the letter D, remember that is regular verb. Tasted. 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 PP verb. Tasting. It's the same. Tasted. 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 Remember, remember, regular verb, the simple present is, is, is normal taste and the simple past and the past participle is the same. Tasted. Tasted. Oh. Okay. Same y case with. Go ahead. Pron pronunciación también. Pronunciation. Similar. Taste. Pronunciation, Simple present. Taste. Similar. Simple past. Tasted. Past tasted. participle. Tasted. It's the same. It's the same pronunciation. Ah. Oh. So, could you spell this word, please? Which one? Tasted. It's on the chat. Taste. I chatted you. Wait. In the chat. Can you check the chat? It tasted free. Do you see it, Jenny? Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Okay, so this is related to food. This is related to food, right? Tasted, tasted. It's the same. Simple pass and pass participle. Try. Try is the simple present. Try. What is the simple past? Tried. Tried. What is the PP verb? It's the same. The same. Tried. Okay. These verbs, these three verbs, eat, taste, and try, you can use them when it comes about food. You can use them, okay? For example, have you ever tried, Catherine, tried, okay? Tried. Korean, Korean food. Korean food. Korean, you know Korean? 
Korean yeah. is the nationality of which country? Uh, nationality. Is the nationality of where? Where for, for Korea? Korea, correct. Korea is the country and um, Korean is the nationality. Okay. okay. Have okay. you ever tried? Have you ever tried? Tried is the verb. Tried is the verb. Have you ever tried Korean food, my dear? No, I haven't tried Korean food. Good, you haven't tried Korean food. Uh, would you like to try Korean food in the future? Yes. Yes, yes, maybe, huh? Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, how about you, uh, Catherine? Have you have you ever tried Korean food? No, I haven't. You haven't tried either? Korean haven't food. Tried. Wow. Would you like to try in the future? Mm, no. Not really. It's not interesting not for you? Really. No. <laughs> what would you prefer? Um, what? Um, I mean, you Chinese food. Repeat, I would prefer. Repeat, I would. I would. Prefer, uh, I would, I yes. would prefer China food. Chinese. Chinese food, yeah. Yes, Chinese. remember we use the nationality with the food, like yeah. Salvadorian food, Mexican food, Korean <laughs> food, Chinese. Oh, I think Chinese food is the best, is the best food of China, of, of Asia, I'm sorry, of the Asian yeah. continent. I think Chinese food is the is the best. Okay. In you, teacher? Me? Uh, no, I haven't tried it. I haven't tried it yet. But I'm not really sure, you know, if I'm interested to try <laughs> Korean Korean food. <laughs> but like Jenny said, like Jenny said, I second Jenny. I second Jenny. Um, I would prefer Chinese food for sure, for sure. You know, <laughs> this kind of rice, Cantonese, Cantonese rice, Cantonese ah, yeah. rice. Oh my goodness, that's the bomb! Yeah, yes, <laughs> yeah. delicious. <laughs> it's awesome. Yes, it's delicious. It's it's yummy, yummy. <laughs> <laughs> How about you, Anna? Anna, can you chat us? Can you chat us your answer, Anna? If you have tried Korean food, okay. I I have tried it. it. You have tried it. Have <laughs> Korean food? Yes. <laughs> tell us, tell us, what's it like? Is it good? Is it a little? Acid, I don't know. Is it salad or, or, or it's sweet? Uh -huh, it's a salty, salty. Oh, salty, yeah, thank you. Or, or like spicy. Uh huh. Where did she go? Anna? Hello, I. I know, I know, honey. Okay, and we have a lot of questions for you. <laughs> okay, let's move to the next question. Can you check? Can you say the next question? Let me see who's next. Uh, let me see. My dad, can you help us? Okay. How would you bronze your dictionary today? What is the verb? Brought. 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 How do you say brought? How do you say brought? Brought. Traer. Traer, correct. Brought. What is what is the the simple present? Mm. Bring. 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 Mm. Bring. The simple past is brought. And the simple, pa I'm, I'm sorry, the past participle is the same. It's brought. Brought. It's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of good. It's kind of good. 
So remember that bring, brought, brought. So the question is, have you brought your dictionary today? Jenny, have you? Have you have you brought your dictionary today? Oh, sorry, <laughs> my 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 pro <laughs> your connection, your connection. Yeah, I said sorry, but no, I I I haven't uh, brought my dictionary today for today. Okay, there are two ways to answer, right? No, I haven't. Okay. I haven't brought. I haven't brought my dictionary. My dictionary. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. that, that's what you said, right? I haven't brought I haven't brought my dictionary today, or I haven't brought it. I yes? haven't yeah, I I haven't brought, brought it. Brought it. Brought it. Brought it. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes, teacher. Brought it. Brought it. Brought it. Okay. Brought no, I haven't brought it. Okay. Okay. Have you brought your dictionary today, Catherine? No, I haven't brought it. <laughs> Good. Okay. I guess you don't need to bring a dictionary because you have internet connection. So you just log into an online dictionary, right? How about you, my day? Have you brought your dictionary? <laughs> No, no, I haven't brought it. You haven't brought it. Okay, no problem. What about you, Anna? Have you brought your dictionary? No, I haven't brought it. Excellent. I got it. I got it. I, got it, it <laughs> I have to take advantage of this moment, Anna. Okay, Anna, can you read the last question? The last question. <laughs> Have you read the last Harry Potter book yet? Okay, two no. corrections, two corrections. The verb, what is the verb? Read. 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 Wait, the read. verb is read. Read. Oh. read is in the simple present, correct? Yes. yes. What is the simple past? Read. 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 You right. spell it the same. The spelling is the same as well as on the PP verb is the same, but the pronunciation is just like the color red. Correct. Repeat. Read. Read. Red. 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 So <laughs> have you read? Have you read the latest? Latest. latest. Latest is like the most actual. Have you read the latest Harry Potter book yet? Have you brought have you have you read the latest Harry Potter book yet, Ana Lopez? I haven't read it. Yet. Correct. I haven't read it. Repeat, I, I read haven't it. read it. I haven't. I haven't read it. <laughs> you got it. Okay, how about you, Jenny? Have you no, read the latest Harry Potter, Harry Potter book yet? Uh, no, I haven't read it. Are you going to? No, I haven't. Wait, wait, wait. You have, yeah. you say, you have it, right? I haven't. Now, my next uh -huh. question is, are you going to? No. no. Yes. No. Okay. No. no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Correct, correct. You got it. What about you, Catherine? No, I haven't. Read uh -huh. it. I'm sorry? No, I haven't. I haven't? Read it. Read, read. read. I... read it. Read. <laughs> read it's it. like saying in Spanish, I... no lo he leído, right? No, I haven't read it. <laughs> No, I haven't read it. Read it. Okay. Can you make a different question? Can you make a different question? For example, have you tasted? Yes. 
have you tasted? And you change the information. Instead of goat cheese, you change the question. For example, have you tasted pasta? Or have you tasted Italian food? Have you tasted Italian food, Ana Lopez? Yes, I've I taste, tasted it. Tasted it. Tasted it. Yes, I've I have I've yes, I've tasted it. Thank you. Have you tasted Italian food, Catherine? Yes. I have tasted it. Yes, I have tasted it. <laughs> have you brought? Have you brought? Have you ever tried? Have you read? Okay. Let me see. Have you ever tried? Have you ever tried Mexican food? Jenny, have you ever tried Mexican food? Yes, I tried it. I think you kind of love it. Yeah. <laughs> What's your favorite typical Mexican food? Oh, tacos. Tacos. <laughs> there is a variety among the Mexican food, right? Yeah. Like tacos, burritos, gringas. Oh, yeah. There's a variety there. All right, good to know. Can you make a different question, Jenny? Can you make a different question for your classmates? Okay, have you ever, have you ever cooked it? Um, have you ever cooked it? Um, um, uh, it's Spain, it's Spain food. Okay. No, I haven't. Cook. cook. Repeat, cook. 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 Okay, cook. simple pass and PP verb. Cooked. 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 Cook. Cook. Cooked. 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 Have you ever cooked? Have you ever cooked? This is a kind of difficult verb to pronounce, okay? So, have you ever cooked what, miss? Spain food. Spanish. Ah, uh, Spanish. Yes. Have you ever cooked Spanish food? Uh -huh. Wow, okay. Answer, ladies, answer. Catherine, my day, Anna, have you? No, I haven't. I haven't. I mean, I haven't cooked. Yeah. Cooked it. Cooked. Cooked, cooked it. it. I cooked haven't it. cooked it. It's a little <laughs> difficult one. Cooked it. <laughs> cooked <laughs> it. I haven't cooked it. <laughs> I haven't cooked it. Repeat again, please. Cooked. Cooked it. It. Cooked, cooked it. it. I haven't cooked, cooked it. Cooked it. This Jenny is making mm. us suffer, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. No, it's okay. It's okay. We improve this way. We improve this way. Do you have a question for us before we finish, Catherine? Do you have a question for your classmates? Um, okay, okay, okay. Um Can you use the verb read in a present perfect question, Catherine? Um, have you brought, uh, brought, brought, read? I want you to use read. Ah, have you read? Uh huh. Ah, uh, have you read the late, um, Mm. 
Have you read wow. the news? The news? Uh -huh. Have you read the newspaper? Have you read a book? Yes? Okay. Have you read the latest book? The latest, the latest book. Lo que pasa que latest es como el, el, más, el más actual. Entonces tendrías ah, que decir okay. que libro. Ajá. Solo, ah, have you read the new books? Have you read a new, a new book? Have a you read book. a new book? Repeat, have you read a new book? Have you read a new book? Okay. Okay, have you read a new book, uh, my dear? Have you read a new book lately? Mm, Podemos agregarle no. lately ahí al final, eh, Katherine. Lately, permítanme. One second, one second. Lately. lately. Como últimamente, have you read a book lately? My? Lately. How do you say lately? Como ultimamente. Ah, uh, no, I haven't. You haven't? Read. You haven't read. read it. Repeat, I haven't read it. I haven't read it. Correct. I haven't read it. How about you, Jenny? Have you read a book lately? No, I haven't read it. You haven't read it? Time, time. We don't have too much time to, to invest on reading. And reading is, it's one of the greatest hobbies, right? I wish I had more time for reading. It's a good hobby. How about you, Anna? How about you? No, I read it. No, I haven't. Haven't. No, I haven't have read, read, it. read it. I haven't read Repeat. it. Repeat. No, I haven't read it. No, I haven't read it. Very well. My dear, can you make one question to finish with? Um, you have a real... Have you read? Have you read 65 Gray? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> What's that? That's a book, right? That's a book? <laughs> okay. Can you repeat the question for the class? Attention. Have you read? No. Have you read? Have you read? Guys, guys, have you read or have you read? Have you read? Read. read. Have you read? 55 grade book. 55 grade book, great book. Have you read that book, ladies? Jenny? No, I no, haven't I read. Haven't. I you haven't, haven't read. read it. Okay, how about you, Catherine? Have you read it? No, I haven't read it. You haven't read it? <laughs> how about you, Anna? Have you read it? No, I haven't read it. You haven't read it. You girls, we just had a full practice with Present Perfect. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, clean, your, <laughs> clean your sweat. Wow, your brain has been, you know, exposed today. And sad thing is that we were not complete, you know, as far as attendance, but it's a benefit for you because you actually kind of have a personalized class today. So this is going to be a topic that little by little you will manage, you will master. I'm very happy for that. You have any questions so far? No, no. it's okay. We almost finished this module, right? We have only two more classes this week. And then I think two more classes next week, something like that. So let's enjoy these last hours together, okay? I hope to see you tomorrow <laughs> at 8 p.m. Okay, thank you so okay, much. Teacher. Good night. Be safe. Thank Goodbye, you. Bye, guys. Night, thank Bye, you. Bye-bye. My pleasure. Bye. Goodbye. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye.